right, y'all. Uh, Billboard reports that Beyonce's Renaissance World Tour is looking to bring in over $500 million, I said $500 million, which will mark the tour as her highest grossing to date and in exceeding the gross of her own to previous tours. The Renaissance Tour resets the record for the highest grossing tour by an R&B artist or black artist uh, in box score history, the outlet reports. I'm telling y'all, I went to Beyonce's show uh, Saturday, and it was the most amazing show I've ever seen in my life. Honestly, I'm serious, bro. It is, and if you don't, if you ain't seen it or you didn't get a chance to see it, please go see it before it's over. Where was the show? It was at the uh, Mercedes Benz. It was the, at the football where they do football. And, and it was Benz. sold out. It was sold out, and it was crazy. I, I, I can't even uh, the, the stage, the production. Uh, it was so it was futuristic. It was everything. Her vocals was on point. Like she ain't miss no no. Oh, when they got to the song that love on top, Ricky, you have to go. You have oh. to figure out how to get there. When they do love on top, she stopped singing at the end, and the whole crowd do all the modulating. They, when I tell you they hit every single note and you could feel yeah. like it feel like it's anointed. And all, all of the key changes too. All of the key changes. The crowd does it. And she sing it. She sing with them a little bit too. And then she stop and they just take it away. It is amazing. It gave me goosebumps. I mean, she flying all around. I mean, everything. There is nothing that she missed in this in this concert. Blue Ivy, they were so cute together. It was it, it was amazing. The outfits, the dancers, the the sound. Nothing went wrong. If it did, you would never know. Like, she, that lady performed for like three hours, Lord. Right. Uh huh. So how much a ticket cost if you were trying to get one, like, for the night? How much would a ticket cost on I don't know. About? I think some of them are, uh, some of them, they, they have some good deals. I can't guarantee you the best seat. But just being in the I'm building. talking about like a, a decent seat. Is it like $1,500, $2,000? I think no. you can get a good one for three, four hundred dollars for I real. seen them today on Ticketmaster for $200 in the section 100 section. Cause this is the last day, so Mm-mm. you know I, I know it was it was sold out when, when when I was there. It was packed. I mean, it was packed to the gills, to the very, very, very top. Cause and they then, originally only planned to do one show in Atlanta, right? And they add did they add those two shows? I thought they it may added have been two, two, two and okay. they added one. Okay. No, 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 they added two more. There's two three more. shows total. Right. right. Wait, so a minute, they add, wait, wait a minute. They added two more shows in Atlanta. It was yeah. a show Friday. Mm-hmm. It was one Saturday, and now it's one tonight. Yeah. At the Mercedes Benz. You it, can get a ticket for 400 bucks. When I tell you, oh my God, it's something y'all don't want to miss in your lifetime, for real. Like, yeah, I've man. been to every, not every concert, but I've been to some great shows. I don't want to mention Bro, names. What you wish you get about three, four million a show, you think, if you had to oh guess. My- Oh my God! Yeah, she get a cut of them tickets, dog. I, I don't know, but she she definitely making her money, but she deserves it. She works, Absolutely. Ricky. She works. Mm. Okay. Yeah. Ain't no intermission. Ain't no stop to go get you something to drink. She works. So okay. the concert was like three hours for real. It don't feel like three hours. You are wow. thoroughly entertained every. She take second. y'all ass down through there. Oh, she take you down through there. She she. Oh my God! I just. I'm so proud of her. Like, we were signed to the same label, Columbia Records. It was Destiny's Child. Was, all of us, uh, Criss Cross, Escape, you know, So So Deaf, we came through them. So uh, we did remixes with them for uh, Survivor. I'm on the Survivor remix. With, like, we, we did Where the Party At. They was dancers in the background of the video. Like, we came up with them. So to see her, to see Atlanta shut down for this woman and to see just, like, the power of hard work and perseverance and performance, like, mm. It, it it's just amazing to me. It's breathtaking, and I'm so proud of her. Did I she, saw Jay Z. He was he was there. The really? other children were there. It, it was it was beautiful to see. It was wow. almost like a reunion. Did she do real. lemonade? to sound like when Jay Z was cheating on her. They talking. Man. Oh, oh yeah. she did crazy in love because they still are very much crazy in love. No, tell <laughs> <laughs> And I'm gonna wrap up the hotspot on that note, y'all. We are gonna pray for Gary because we got the praise mix down coming up with the White Stone. And the time now is 26 minutes. You the top of the hour. It's the Ricky Smiley Morning Show.